Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll be discussing an exciting development in the world of luxury yachts. To be honest, this one is in its league, specifically the Saudi Arabian $8 billion floating city, Pangaos the Terra Yacht. This mega yacht is an engineering and design marvel, and we'll go over all of the details. So without further ado, let's take a look at Saudi Arabia's $8 billion floating city concept, Pangaos the Terra Yacht. Pangaos, the turtle-shaped 8 billion Terra Yacht in Saudi Arabia, dubbed the world's largest floating structure ever built, will be home to yet another one-of-a-kind architectural marvel. Pangaos is a turtle-shaped Terra Yacht designed by Lazzarini Design Studio, an Italian firm that specializes in artistic visualization and prototyping. Pangaos will be 1,800 feet long and 2,000 feet wide at its widest point. The Terriot will include a variety of hotels, shopping centers, parks, ship and aircraft ports, and other facilities required to house up to 60,000 people in the middle of the ocean. The Terriot will include a variety of hotels, shopping centers, parks, ship and aircraft ports, and other facilities required to house up to 60,000 people in the middle of the ocean. It got its name from the supercontinent Pangaea, which existed millions of years ago during the late Paleozoic and early Mesozoic eras before the world's continents drifted apart. So how exactly will this mega yacht function? Each fully electric motor on board is capable of 16,800 horsepower and is powered by various onboard energy sources. The structure will be able to cruise at a speed of 5 knots. The large wings will gain energy from the breaking of the waves while sailing, allowing Pangaos to cruise indefinitely without emitting any greenhouse gases. The rooftop of the structure is lined with solar panels, which will provide some of the clean energy required to power the Terra Yacht. The hull has nine bows and is subdivided into several blocks with a draft of 30 meters. This path leads from the port area's entrance to the main square, which extends into a wide terraced villa and then leads to private houses, buildings, and rooftop terraces. The structure will also have an upper shell zone that will allow flying vehicles to land easily. The lower space portion of the structure is designed to house 30,000 cells or cluster compartments and provide an unsinkable floating solution for the basement, which will be realized in steel. A terriot, on the other hand, necessitates the construction of a Terra shipyard, which can hold the massive structure and fill it with water to float the Terra yacht into the sea. While Pangaos is still a concept, Lazzarini hopes it will evolve into something more than computer animation soon. An approximate value of $8 billion will be needed to build the Terra yacht, with a timeline of just under eight years. Due to the project's large scale, Lazzarini is currently in the process of launching its first crowdfunding initiative to make the project a reality. The virtual editions of areas on the watercraft can be purchased as part of the NFT collection, allowing users to collect specific content and access virtual properties using their credentials. The same credentials will also work as a property deposit if the project is constructed. Now let's move on to the design and specifications of this future concept. The Pangaos Terriot will be a floating city, with a design inspired by the shape of a turtle. The city will be built around a central shell structure that will house the majority of the residential and commercial spaces, such as hotels, restaurants, and entertainment venues. The shell will be surrounded by six legs that will serve as docking stations for yachts and boats. Renewable energy sources, such as solar and wind power, will power the city. To ensure sustainability, it will also have its own waste management and water treatment systems. The shell city will have luxurious living areas. Residents of Pangaos Terriot will have access to luxurious living spaces such as apartments, villas, and townhouses. The apartments will have breathtaking views of the sea, while the villas will have private gardens and swimming pools. The townhouses will be geared towards families with plenty of space and privacy. It will also include one-of-a-kind experiences. Water sports, diving, and marine life observation will be among the unique experiences available to residents of the floating city. It will also include a spa and wellness center as well as a shopping mall and a cinema. In addition, cultural events and festivals will be held in the city, making it a vibrant and diverse community. What will be the location and timeline of this sea project? The Terriot will be built off the coast of the Red Sea near the Saudi city of Neom. The project, which is expected to take eight years to complete, will be a major draw for tourists and investors from all over the world, which seems to be the main objective. According to their websites, they are confident in their ability to build it and have everything planned out. They also stated that Pangaos will travel throughout the world. According to the website, Pangaos will be perpetually itinerant around our planet Earth 
with an infinite number of self-sustaining destinations. With that, now let's see the potential impact of Turtle City. The Pangaeos Terra Yacht Project has the potential to have a substantial economic impact in Saudi Arabia. The project is expected to generate billions of dollars in revenue and create thousands of jobs. It will also bring in foreign investors and tourists, which will boost the local economy and open up new growth opportunities. The project's commitment to sustainability will benefit the environment as well. The floating city will reduce its carbon footprint and impact the surrounding marine ecosystem by utilizing renewable energy sources and implementing waste management and water treatment systems. No big innovation comes without challenges and criticism, and the Terra Yacht is no exception. Despite its many benefits, the Pangaeos Terra Yacht project has received some criticism and challenges. Some have questioned the project's viability due to the technical challenges of building and maintaining a floating city. Others have criticized the project's price tag, which some believe is exorbitant given the country's economic difficulties. Furthermore, some people are concerned about the project's potential impact on the marine ecosystem. While the project's sustainability measures are a step in the right direction, it remains to be seen how effectively they will be implemented and whether they will be sufficient to protect the vulnerable marine environment. Overall, the Pangaeos Terra Yacht project represents a daring and forward-thinking vision of luxury living and sustainable development in the future. While there will undoubtedly be difficulties and criticism, the project's potential to create jobs, generate revenue and attract investment and tourism makes it an appealing prospect for Saudi Arabia and the rest of the world. If Saudi authorities reach an agreement on a new mega-project, construction of a floating city in King Abdullah's port will begin by the end of 2023 and take about 8 years. Pangaeos Terriot, when completed, could be the world's largest floating structure. Pangaeos may be launched in the metaverse by Lazzarini in order to raise funds for the project. And that brings us to the end of our video on Saudi Arabia's $8 billion floating city Pangaeos the Terra Yacht. If it gets built, it will be an engineering marvel that showcases the best of what modern technology and design can achieve. It's a luxurious vessel that hopes to offer its owner and guests a lifestyle that will be unparalleled in its extravagance. Well, that's it. For now, we bring an end to this video but we will come back with some new and interesting videos in the future. Till then, make sure that you like our video. We hope you enjoyed learning about this incredible yacht. Do you think this concept will become a reality in the future? Let us know what you think. And if you have any comments or questions, please leave them below. Subscribe to the channel to get videos from us regularly and do not forget to hit the bell icon to never miss an update. Thanks for watching the video and we will see you at the next one.